it's reaching levels of or depths of bad that I didn't know would be hit with this roster because when I think about the teams that like have the longest losing streaks, which for the record is 28 games between two seasons in one single season, I think it's 26 games. So the Pistons are very close to NBA history in the worst way, but those are the process Sixers. Like they were trying Trying to lose lose Mm -hmm. with bad players on the court. No core. Kate Cunningham, Asar Thompson, Jay Nivey, uh, where I say story, like James Wiseman, Jalen Duran. Like, there's people here, bro. 24 in a row? That's bad, bro. <clears throat> I, I think, to me, that's the biggest part is the fact that – and I thought about it because I don't know if you've seen that that tweet that's kind of been going around with the dude. I think his name is uh, Matthew Sponhauer. He tweeted, like, which mm-hmm. is worse, being a Pistons fan or being a Panthers fan? And, like, the, my thought process was, like, Panthers, because, one, they don't have their picks. Like, you right. know, besides Bryce Young, you have nothing really looking for. Is he to, just like, talking current? Just, like, yeah, like, right now. Just oh, like, I would say right. at least the Pistons, I mean, they had a bad boys moment. Oh, and no, no, they no, got no. The, And they got the 4 chip. I was like, I don't think the Pan- Panthers are a younger franchise yeah. and never won a Super Bowl. Yeah, nah. He's talking about, like, just, like, right now moving okay. forward, which is worse. And I was like, yeah, Panthers have, like, no, they don't even have their pick this year. Like they're about to get no. the first pick, and they're not even gonna have it. And then Pistons, I'm like, bro, they still have, like you said, K. Cunningham, Jaden Ivy, Asar Thompson, Jalen Duran. They still have pieces. So then, to me, that's the craziest part is the fact that they have players that I actually like, and I'm looking forward to their futures. And I think they're good players, even like right now, I think they're good players. So the fact that they're on a 24 game losing streak with these like solid pieces is kind of crazy to me. It's like, bro, you guys can't win one like you don't even have, you know I'm not saying you got to be a good team not right. saying you got to you guys got to even be a decent team but like like you said this is historically bad for a team that should not be this bad like for 24 game losing streak bro like that's a g league team out there like didn't we say it when it was at i was when they were at like 10 or 13 losses in a row i was like no nba team has any business of losing that many games in a row no none especially not with solid players on the team 24 like like i just said bro the teams that set the record were intentionally trying to lose right with throwing no names out there like literally people off the street in the line in the starting lineup bro y'all are you have a, a core like i have a legit core <laughs> right and like a coach y'all just paid all this money to that's supposed to like help develop this core again we just had the offseason where they were talking about k cunningham was dogging team usa bro i don't it's think it's a ta- right it's not a talent issue <laughs> It's not a talent issue. Bro, so, they're good, bro. They have they have good pieces. I just I I don't know, bro. I don't get it. To me, it don't make sense. All the ingredients is there, bro. Did somebody need to chef it up. Whoever cooking right now, I need to get fired. Just off the grill immediately. <laughs> uh,